What's up YouTube, Jeff back from SamiGuru.com. Today we're gonna to be talking about the Galaxy Z Flip 7. Specifically, the number one thing you wanna do when you get this phone out of the box is you wanna be able to utilize all of the apps on the cover display. By default, you're not able to run every single app on your cover display out of the box. You can only run certain widgets, which is obviously not what most people want. People wanna be able to run any application they want. And by default, that's something you cannot do. But if you use GoodLock, which is Samsung's customization suite, you can add any applications you want via the GoodLock launcher. And there's actually a way that you can run them natively, uh, but there's, the apps are a little more restrictive. So I'm gonna show you guys both methods, plus other tips and tricks for running things on the cover display in this video. So let's go ahead and get started. To do this, we are gonna need to actually open up the phone here to the larger display just to kind of get started and show you guys how to go about doing this. Before we do get started, I wanna remind you guys, make sure you check out our website, samiguru.com. Cover the latest Samsung news, tips, tricks, tutorials, and reviews. Uh, we have full writing team over there. You can also get our mystery box program. If you haven't ordered a device yet, if you want to order, you can get a free case cleaning kit, desktop, phone stand, other randomly inserted goodies. Just head over to the website. What you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and tap on the device of your interest. Uh, and then this will take you directly to our link. Order your device from Samsung's website uh, using our link. And then come back to the website and go over to our verification page. When you go to the verification page here, you will see uh, the way to verify the device down here where it says verification form. Fill that out with your shipping address and you will get your box. The box is shipped by July 31st. I'll put the link in the pinned comment description if you guys haven't ordered yet and you'd like to order and participate in the mystery box program. So let me show you guys how to enable the apps on the cover display. The easiest way to do this is to go down to your advanced features section and go to labs. Right here, you can turn on use main screen navigation for cover screen. I highly recommend that as well because you can use your gesture navigation. That's one thing. I'm actually going to make a video of the first things to do with your Z Flip 7. That's another thing I'd recommend, even though it's not the primary focus of this video. The other one is apps allowed on the cover screen, which is a labs feature. But if you tap on this, you'll notice there's only a small subset of the devices, uh, of the apps I have installed. It's only Google Maps, Google Messages, Samsung Messages, Netflix, and YouTube that can be allowed by default. Now, this will allow you to place a widget that gets you apps on the cover screen, but only these specific five apps, which isn't still ideal because you might want to run other apps. The way to do that is to get Multistar. So Multistar is Samsung's uh, add-on for GoodLock. And if you don't know what GoodLock is, I highly recommend, instead of just tapping on the button, you go to the Galaxy Store and then download GoodLock as well because GoodLock has just a wealth of great features. And on my channel, we cover a lot of those. So if you subscribe, you'll see even more of this. But download the GoodLock module. So once you install Multistar, you can actually use the full power of it. Because if you just tap on it from the Z Flip 7 setting menu, you're not gonna unlock the full power of Multistar. So if we tap open and go into GoodLock, you can download Multistar directly from there as well. And it's right here. You can see I already have installed, but you can download the module from here. And then you can open it directly from GoodLock. And then there's a section called I Love Galaxy Foldable. So you're going to tap on this. And you have three things here now. Last year, they only had these two. We're really focusing on this, which is the launcher widget. This will let you add any applications that you want. So you can have your Amazon shopping. I already have a sauna there. I can have my chat GPT up there. I've got Discord there, I can have my DoorDash, order some food, eBay, do some other shopping. You can see right there, you've got your, your aspect ratio up here for the launcher widget, how you want it. Uh, you can keep adding applications too. It's not just limited to what you see there. You can just keep adding as many applications as you want. And you can see, this is not restricted. You can do you know whatever you want. You don't have to add just a certain subset. Here I have 16 different applications that I can now add as a widget to my cover screen and launch any of these apps on that cover display. Now, before we go though, the game widget allows you to play certain games from Game Snacks on your cover display. Once again, up here, we'll let you see this in a grid format. It has two by default, Stack Bounce and Tiger Run, but you can add some other fun games. And this is a fun thing to add uh, to your, your cover display, just because you know if you're killing time somewhere, waiting for an appointment, a doctor's office, whatever, you're at the DMV, you can play some stuff on your cover display without even having to open your flip. So make sure you have the launcher widget enabled. Once you do that, let's go ahead and go back to our cover screen. Probably take my camera a second to get that in focus. 
And then once we do that, you'll notice you can place the widget. So I have some widgets over here for my now brief and everything. Over here, you can place the launcher widget, which you guys can see right there. It's got all 16 applications that I just placed. I can open my Reddit app, which is Relay for Reddit. Uh, you can see I can use my gestures because I enabled gestures on the cover display. I can do some shopping on Amazon, you know, whatever I want to do. And now with the full screen display on the Z Flip 7, this is absolutely fantastic. It looks absolutely beautiful. You got plenty of room to browse on Amazon, use ChatGPT, read your emails, um, you know, Slack, Discord, whatever you want. And then over here, I have a Spotify widget. This is the regular apps widget. So first of all, if you want to place more widgets, you can just long press down here and then you can edit your individual widgets. But again, this widget is just the regular apps widget. Let me actually show you guys what happens. This just takes you back to the apps allowed on cover screen that we were in before. So keep that in mind. Now, if you want to edit all of your widgets, you can scroll down to where it says cover screen, go to widgets, scroll down and find multi-star, and you can place the launcher, which gives you those apps. And then I mentioned the game snacks here. You can add that as another widget. And of course, you can also rearrange all of your widgets. So if I don't want the games as my second one, obviously I usually like to have the apps as my primary. And honestly, I usually delete this one because it's kind of redundant. Once you have the multi-star widget, you can have any apps you want. So why would I want the basic one that limits it to basically five? Anyway, other things you can do, cover screen timeout, notifications, all this good stuff set up from your cover screen. And of course, you can also add and customize the brand new emojis cover displays, which I have the donut and the stars there in this particular video. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it's very useful to get all of your apps working on the cover screen. Like, comment, subscribe again. Check out samiguru.com. If you guys haven't ordered yet a device, you can get it on the Mystery Box program by going over to our website, ordering through our link, and submitting the verification form. Appreciate you guys checking out this video. And of course, I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.